claw simulation. Fuck that. I feel like it's going to break everything. All right. Gear I got lock it in. This is a Gaeddon's Attack on Titan fan game. Um, I saw an, an article on Destructoid about it. And it looks pretty awesome. So let's just uh, start out on tra training. I'll put in the link to the article and this guy's YouTube channel slash NDDB link so you can go and try this out yourself. They have it in both 32 and 64 OSs, which is really nice. Let's just try the tutorial here. If you don't want Attack on Titan or Shingeki, Shingeki no Kyojin is, I, uh, I strongly urge you to try it out. this music down. Alright, I'm um, using a keyboard for this. And it's all made by one guy. It's, it uses the Unreal Engine. So the main thing here, um, a little bit about the about what Attack on Titan is. It's been it's essentially the last group of humanity living in sort of a sanctuary. There's several layers of walls that are used to protect themselves against Titans, which are these giant humanoid monsters that eat them. And the only way you can stop them is by slicing the nape of their neck. And in order to get that, because they're s freakishly tall. Uh, maybe we'll see one later. Uh, you use these 3D maneuvering gear that uses gas and hooks, like essentially grappling hooks, and you get two of them to maneuver around space in order to get to that point. And um, I feel like it's a lot like Gantz, really, of how realistic it is. It's very gory. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, shit. Uh, 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 come on, come on, come on! There we go, there we go! Okay, cool. Hit a wall with a certain angle to perform a wall run. Alright. <laughs> I appreciate that encouragement game, but, um... Oh, man. So you get a little bit of play in the air. But... I'm so bad at this game! Um... I'm still having fun, though. Can I just do that easy? Okay. I'm not really following arrows. I don't know if I need to. Go oh, attacks. The hint system's really good. Oh, that's nice. So it's like a sort of like a... As you're going past them attack. Oh, let's try that again. Because I want to do cool things, but I can't. So this is what I was talking about, spatial, um... Hmm. Yeah, okay. 
Let me just get on the roof. Oh my god, let me get on the Washington Monument. Okay. Cool, we're angered. <laughs> How do I know when to release it? Alright, we're gonna try it again. Nope. I wanna at least kill it. Do I need an anchor on him with the hook? Hmm. Maybe I need to do it from the walls. Okay. Okay. It's all about angles. Um... Angles are not my strong point, apparently. So he just did this. Ugh. I'll try it later. Let's try out a race? Let's do a race. Just a simple race. Uh, I imagine there's tons of people doing this way cooler. Just one more time. One, one more. One more. Before I try to save humanity. So if I stop moving, I am... Hmm. I, I can't even see that hook from where I was. Uh, <laughs> This is longer than last time, oh my god! Well, I guess that... Uh, that bug thing was kind of weird. Anyways, let's just pretend I didn't have four weeks of training camp to do this. Okay, guess we're just racing. Let's try the second one. There's a lot of stuff that's not inside of this demo that he's already working on. Like, you can fight, uh, you can actually fight the titans. So if you hit any surface, you're pretty much fucked. It's pretty cool. Um, I think... Uh-oh, uh-oh. Maybe I'm just an above average person, and I need to be okay with that. The one thing that's always really important to me about kind of mixing up gaming in general is um, ways to make movement, which is basically the thing you're going to do the most, no matter what game you're playing. Interesting. You know, and um, like parkour, that's kind of been the big buzzword. big thing that everyone's trying to do. And sort of like, make that interesting. Because uh, the mechanics largely going to stay the same. Uh, uh, uh. 
And so seeing this really, um, really caught my attention. Because that was the most interesting thing to me about um, Attack on Titan. Is this 3D maneuvering gear, and um, yeah, you get points for cutting those guys. I can't do that. There's so much. There's a lot actually to learn right here, and um, I really hope the guy gets to finish the game, cause this is already interesting, just from this little demo. Um. If you want to see people that are actually great at this, I've, I've seen one that in the title was just all S's. I won't be the person to watch for that. Did I miss the last one? I see. I'm gonna... I'm gonna let, let's let's just do the simple one. Let's see if I can beat my score on that one. Because, uh... It's a short thing. And if... I don't know... If you can just sort of... Get how it feel. Because, I mean, it's essentially just two grappling hooks. If you want to just break the game down into um, the simplest things. And just call it a day, but the feeling you get is what's important about it. You know, it feels great. I hit that one bug just because of geometry or whatever. That doesn't fucking matter. And otherwise, another thing, like, you just gotta get good at it, you know, like, it's not like anything else out there. Oh, why did I not, up, oh, my overall is a B. So I have to do this on S a lot just to change that into an S. That's, uh, that's pretty cool. Ish. Maybe. I don't know if that's a good thing. Uh. And for these long straights, you want to just, uh, oh. You want to make sure you use both of them. That's sort of the only tip I can give you. <clears throat> Come on! I was not paying attention to the reticle, because, uh, green means go. <laughs> okay, I think that's enough, but, um, I hope s at least it'll pique your interest to go and try it, because it's, it's a short download, 383 megabytes. I think it was maybe, maybe I, my internet, or on any DB side. It kind of took a little bit more than usual, but don't let that discourage you. Because, you know, this is probably the most interesting fan game of an anime that I've seen. In my life. I really wanted to do well, and I want more people to see it. Like, the guy in his Twitch, his hour-long Twitch thing, is like, I, it was great for him to see other people have fun with his game, because he's, like, been working on a year. I think he talks about he's trying to release it in three years. So just getting more people excited about it and to see it, and hopefully no season assist ever. That'd be really good. Just let this guy make this fan game, because it looks a whole lot better than the one they released. 
on the PS3 and shit in Japan. Ah, oh, that was bad. Now I'm just trying to strong arm it. I don't even understand now. Am I... Am I getting closer to an A now? Okay, it's still an A. But it was a B. Maybe my overall. I don't know how grades work. Anyways, totally give it a try. I'll leave all the descriptions in the stuff. And maybe... A weird fan question like that. Um, that's VMU, by the way, where you need to watch batteries and you need it to save your games. Cause I'm planning on doing some Dreamcast stuff soon. What's another thing that's kind of cool to know about video games? Eh. Uh. Well. This off the top of my head is real bad. Oh, maybe this. Maybe this is better. Um, just from what you've seen, maybe you haven't seen any of Attack on Titan. If he, since it is a fan game, doesn't necessarily have to follow the lore. What city would be a really cool thing to fight in? You know, you're fighting like these ginormous humanoid monsters, and they're just attacking a city. What place would be probably the coolest to go after, you know? Just a sort of a metropolitan kind of area. Whenever I think of, like, dangerous things happening in a city, it's always, like, Resident Evil, Fide, or Biohazard, uh, Tokyo. That always looks cool. So, But I was thinking, like, maybe, you know, London. You know, like, imagine just using 3D moving gear around Big Ben or whatever. Maybe that's not in London. I don't know geography. Or doing it on the Eiffel Tower. Or along the Great Wall of China. That'd be just cool. Just like, how many P uh, Titans can you get while just running along it? Because then you won't even have to, you couldn't rely on, you know, the geography. You would rely on the placement of the Titans. That'd be a really cool thing to see. So, yeah. Or maybe even the Grand Canyon. That'd be cool. Yeah. So, uh, leave that in the comments. If you give it a try, you know, if I helped you, if I introduced you to something cool, made you think about something cool, just leave it in the comments and subscribe. Don't forget that. Wah! All right, get out, go log it out. Bye! I should probably stop that because that hurts my heart too.